Monsters, Inc. has always been a pretty fun and recognizable Disney Pixar name, acting as a timeless classic anyone can constantly go back to. While the franchise never became as popular as something like Toy Story, that doesn't make it any less interesting to revisit. From the characters to the dynamics of the monster world, there's just a lot of creativity. It's not only creative though, because it also has a ton of potential for future storylines. If you loved following Mike Wazowski and Sully's adventures and you wanted to see more, then today I have some pretty good news for you. A Monsters, Inc. TV series spinoff was announced back in November of 2017, but since then there hasn't been too many details about what the show would be about until now. What you should probably know right away is that this is officially heading to Disney+, Plus, an upcoming streaming platform with loads of Disney content. It's going to be competing with Netflix, but given that this is the company that'll basically acquire the entire world soon, I think it's definitely going to be successful. Monsters at Work is the title of this spinoff TV series, but you may be a bit confused by the word spin-off. Those usually focus on aspects to something original that weren't really explored too much, and yeah, that's exactly what's about to happen here. While in the movies we followed Mike and Sully, Monsters at Work is taking a bit of a different path as we focus on a brand new main character. Some of the plot details were revealed in this exclusive Hollywood Reporter article. Monsters at Work picks up six months after the original movie with the power plant at its center now harvesting the laughter of children to fuel the city of Monstropolis. The series follows Tyler Tuskman, an eager and talented mechanic on the Monsters Inc. facilities team who dreams of working on the laugh floor alongside Mike and Sully. So yeah, I know not everyone's happy we'll be focusing on a newcomer, but you don't have to worry too much because the movie's iconic duo will be back for more, just this time as supporting characters instead. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. We can luckily keep making those sweet Wazowski memes. What's cool about Monsters at Work is that it not only follows the characters we know, but it's also considered canon in the Monsters Inc. universe. The plot's first sentence makes it clear that this takes place after the first movie, so we'll finally be able to get a real continuation. Monsters University was hilarious, but it wasn't directly going off the events in the first movie, which I found a lot more interesting. Monsters at Work seems like it'll expand the best parts about the franchise, so there's really no reason not to check it out when it releases in 2020. Of course, since this will be a Disney plus original, you have to be ready to give Mickey your hard-earned cash each month. Oh well, hopefully with a bunch of other originals, it'll make the subscription well worth the price. Either way, I'm hyped for the new spin-off series and it'll be pretty, pretty spooktacular. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and come up below let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.